hey guys welcome or welcome back to my channel i am here to do my bi-weekly cash stuffing it is my last paycheck of june technically i was paid june 27th uh however i am filming this on july 7th so pretty much the pay cycle has almost gone and here we are i still have not cash stuffed so um let's just count up this cash and we will get started so we have 100, 150, 200, 250, 300, 350, 370, 390, 410, 430, 450, 470, 490, 510, 530, 550, 570, 590, 610, 630, 640, 50, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 700, 1, and 2. So $702, that is correct. How are you guys doing? Let me know down below. Um, before you see this video, you will, um, prior to that, I did post my um, debt confession for the second quarter and get, definitely check it out. Really excited on the progress of that. Oh my goodness. A lot, a lot, a lot. So I feel like stuff happened and it's like, I don't know, maybe I should update you. I'm thinking of doing a cash on stuffing. I might film that up next. So maybe I'll just save the, save the story for that because of the purchases. But let's start with my change. And I feel like I don't have all of my change in here. I feel like it was kind of all over the place. But I want to stuff everything so that I can do a cash on stuffing. And just, it's, I don't know, it's just been hard. The holiday. Um, oh, that was fun. How was your holiday, guys? Your 4th of July. So I went to a party. Um, to be honest, it was not as fun this time. I was pretty bored. Uh, pretty bored it was a much smaller thing and um, I was everybody around me was you know <laughs> drunk whatever and I wasn't really so maybe that's why but oh yeah there's some change in here I think it just wasn't as fun because like, it was a huge party last time like a ton of people a ton of people and this time around I realized I just showed you my cards <laughs> Uh, this time around it just was much more intimate and everything and um so we therefore like we didn't do as much like last time like people were jamming out to music and karaoke and like a bunch of games and i don't know but it was nice to get out and have some fun okay so the wallet so this is where things get a little funky i have a bunch of receipts in here that i did scan into fetch my referral code is always down below so basically you get um, points accumulated every time you scan your receipt and then sometimes there's bonus categories which you don't have to like figure all of that out and check them off prior like some apps like they'll find the deals for you and you'll get bonus points that way so check it out but i'm gonna put this off to the side i'll need that for my unstuffing so we'll just take this out of the wallet here and i do have some rollover so we have eight dollars which again i'm just going to keep that there for now there was actually 28 dollars but joe borrowed some cash for his haircut he never paid me back in cash so he then paid for something of mine when we went out so i'll show you that guys in a second I'll show you that in a second. That didn't make any sense. So groceries is getting 140. So 140. Coffee is getting its usual $10. And then dining out. So I had budgeted. Oh, yeah, I saw my best friend. That was so much fun. We went for a hike had crazy blisters we were out there for several hours and like we had to turn around because i was not wearing proper socks <laughs> and it's too thin so um, i budgeted a little bit extra in this category um 
actually no, I put it in fun, though it's really the same thing. I just put it in fun to make it easier, but I had budgeted $60, but what I'm doing is um, putting $40 in here. Let me think about this for a second. Oh, I have some money back here still. What's this for? Wait a second. Oh, 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 oh. This was money I threw in my wallet. Let me put this to the side. This I had for the camping stuff and I put the cat the cash in my wallet for it. So let me put this to the side. That is not going to be rollover. That was just like money I threw in there so I could spend it. So I'm trying to think about this. So okay, sorry. I had to think about it for a moment. So basically a 20 that was meant for this category I handed to Joe. Um, it was mine that was meant for my wallet. He then spent it on food for me. So instead of putting 16 here, I'm going to put 40 and that way I can put 20 into here because this is going to be for gas. <laughs> there was just some random amount I was doing. So yeah, hopefully that makes sense. It, see, that's why I don't like when he does that. Like, and like, oh no, I'll pay you back. And da, da, da. Like he was supposed to give me the cash that same day. It's just, he didn't want to like have to go to the bank prior to the haircut. And I like, next time I'm going to tell him like, if you're not going to give me the money right away, I just like for my brain, like I need, I don't know. I just, I need the cash to go back to the category that I was. I just, it just confuses me and messes up my budget. So the wallet is stuffed. So let's do our um, focus binder up next here. And so we are skipping to Teddy and Teddy is getting $15. So Teddy now has 10, 20, 25, 26, 27, $28. Okay, so Teddy emergency is up next. And this is from Jesse Budgets. It is a custom in her shop. Let me get a different color though because I always have my purple on hand. So let's do hmm. Let's do a red. Okay, so I'm doubling up everything here. So I budgeted $20, which means I'm coloring in a $10. So we'll just color over here. We're getting pretty close. It, I mean, visually it looks like we're getting pretty close. We have, yeah, we're probably like halfway through, I would say. Let's take a look here, we'll count it up. So because I colored 10, 20 is going in. So let's see. Okay, so in my high yield I have 100. 200 300 dollars and then 320 40 60 80 90 so 390 dollars okay i guess we're not halfway there <laughs> it looks like we are but we're not i guess i have a lot of heavy hitters yet yeah there's still some heavy hitters it just looks like looks like a lot but i guess i've been coloring in smaller numbers lately Okay, so I decided to skip car insurance, even though my premium came up and I paid it, I decided to skip it. Um, let's see. Looks like that is it for this binder. So let's go to my home binder next. Okay, so we are stuffing a little bit in here. So car maintenance is getting some love. Car maintenance is getting $20. And car maintenance now has 100 in my high yield, but 
In total, we have 150, 170, 190, 200, 210, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So 220 dollars in car maintenance. Okay, so household is getting 20 and that is all that it has. I think I depleted this last time I did a cash on stuffing. And then going right to Sam's Club, same thing here. This one was depleted last time and Sam's Club is getting $30. Let's move here. This is my um, me binder. So we're going to stuff some things in here. <laughs> um, maybe I should mention it and maybe I'll just go more in depth. So I had a mini emergency. I had already put my budget out, but I technically didn't cash stuff. I could technically move my budget around to cover the mini emergency. I have yet to touch my emergency fund, but I think I would rather try to cash flow it. So this 150 I am stuffing, I do have a hair appointment upcoming. Um, and I really didn't want to pull from that. Like I really want to do this for myself. And like I have other means of covering the emergency, even if it means sacrificing a paycheck of stuffing, sinking funds and stuff. I just really didn't want to pull from that and then I normally don't do these videos but I will do it just because it will be quick I do want to finish this challenge but um, I had budgeted $200 for vacation so I'm just going to pull the cash out to not confuse myself Okay, so this here should be $200. So we have 100, 120, 40, 60, 80, 185, 98, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 200. So we're going to put that cash there because we're just going to finish the bougie challenge. So we have $17 to put into this category which we have three, <laughs> whatever, just we'll pull three ones out and put in a 20. And then we'll count up and make sure that's all squared away. But let's put our little stickers down. So we have, and this is from Liz and Les, if I didn't say. Let's see here. Let's put our little ghosty friend here. And I feel like this guy needs a coffee in his little hand. So there we go. How cute. So this guy appears all wasted on his coffee. It's possibly spiked. I'm not sure. But he's kind of a little bit tipsy. So I think something was spiked. <laughs> so, um, so this here should be $100. So $20, $40. 50, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100 dollars. And Okay, so here's the thing. I 
don't know that I want to finish this challenge. Like, I just, at this point, when I get as much cash stockpiled and I feel bad, I'll definitely redo this another time. It feels mean to cut it short, but, I mean, technically, I should have the cash to cover it. Like, let's say, worst case scenario, I rolled all sixes, which is prob um, probability-wise, like, unlikely. <laughs> so... Um, let's say we did. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. So 16 times 6, 96. Yeah. So let's just say, <laughs> let's just say we finish a challenge this way. So this challenge has 100, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33. I know this is silly. I don't know. I just feel bad. I feel like I need to finish the challenges before I put the cash in. I really was neglecting this category, as you guys know. Um, I always feel guilty stuffing for extras, and I'm so focused on debt, but, you know, when you do eventually need to stuff for something, it kind of bites you kind of bites in the butt so let's just let's just combine all cash i'm definitely not going to need to condense this it's getting pretty crazy here oh goodness is that it the rest is ones okay all right, goodness gracious. Okay, so we have in the high yield 100, 200, 300 dollars, 400, 500, 600. So 600 so far, 650, 20, 40, 60, 80, 120. 10, 20, 30, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, Uh, there was a 5 in here. Plus 5. There we go. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. It's getting hard to hold. Wow. Okay. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Okay, that's great. So $915. Um, so 500 of that is going to be for my stay. Uh, we are renting. We're going to Outer Banks in North Carolina and um, renting a house there for the week. And my portion is $500. Oh my gosh. Look at this. That's crazy. Oh my gosh. So my portion is 500. So that means cash so far. I have $415. Oh my gosh, it barely even closes. So I have $415 so far. I might stuff a little bit more when I get paid again. Um, I'd rather over stuff than under stuff. And then if I still have cash left, that'll be good because I, my best friend, since I last talked to you guys, asked me along in mid-August, I don't think I mentioned this, asked me along in mid-August to a mini beach vacate in New Jersey with her, so any cash that's remaining um, can then go towards that, because my stay is covered, uh, meeting her boyfriend, you know, things are getting serious, and, you know, they just invited me along out of the kindness of their heart, so I just have to cover, you know, other things there, and, you know, that sort of thing, so that's exciting. Okay, lastly, I have... Oh, no, I skipped a category. <laughs> Hold on a sec. I'm not used to stuffing this, but I forgot to put in 
um, this seven dollars into Allison. I just had some random, random amount. So seven going into here. I don't really. This is just kind of for whatever I want, I guess. <laughs> no rhyme or reason, really. And now the friends and family binder, which I am going to night out. And it is getting the last $30. And if you are still here, guys, leave me a bear emoji down below. So random, but leave that down below. It lets me know you are still here. And I appreciate you guys. So far, Night Out has 50, 70, 80, 90, 100, 105, 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26. So $126, this is going to pay for a night out with Chris, my thank you to Joe, back, you know, when he was um, stepping it up when I needed help, you know, recovery from surgery. And he always wants to keep going out to eat and stuff, and like, sometimes I have to pull from here lately. Um, and I, like last night I had to put my foot down, I was like, honestly, like, I have been I don't, I can't see where I'm at right now, like with my fun money for this pay cycle. I was like, so technically I probably don't have the money. I was like, I do in some capacity, but it keeps getting taken out of that category for taking you out. So if you want that night to ever happen, my answer is no. <laughs> so I had a little bit of self-control. So that's good but thank you so much for sticking around i'll be filming another cash stuffing very shortly being that i get paid on uh july 11th and then uh shortly thereafter i'll be leaving for vacation so i hope i hope i hope i can get the stuffing in before i go um just so i can kind of situate the cash but thank you again for being here like and subscribe comment and i hope you have a great day bye